Hello friends welcome here. In the past the Flash producers and directors have been refusing to get golden boots for Grant Gustin's Flash, but now season 8 set photos that were leaked online show that Grant Gustin will be wearing the classic golden boots of the Flash. The Flash season 8 is still in the works, and the show is expected to return to the CW just in time for Thanksgiving. Season 8 of the show will begin out with a five-part crossover event dubbed Armageddon, starring Grant Gustin as the titular Scarlet Speedster. The event will be different from past Arrowverse crossovers like Crisis on Infinite Earths since it will take place entirely within the Flash series. Set images from the Flash Season 8 production have lately leaked on the internet, and this newest fresh image provides us an intriguing glimpse at Grant Gustin's costume. He's on the run this time, wearing gold boots. It appears like The Flash is pursuing a more comic book accurate version of Grant Gustin's original costume in this incarnation of the suit. The gold boots are absent from most versions of the Scarlet Speedster's costume, instead opting for a more streamlined red in a near monochromatic style. It'll be fascinating to see how the gold boots appear in motion during action situations, and the color scheme looks fantastic here. In the past Andy Poon the costume designer for the CW's version of The Flash had explained why he doesn't wear golden boots like his comic book counterpart. The distinctive golden boots of the comic book superhero were almost included on the CW's The Flash. However, according to Arrowverse costume designer Andy Poon, the gold boots looked too cartoony to bring to life, so the show ultimately passed on the design. He had said that I've done concept of the gold boot, looks too cartoony. Earth 2 Flash was fairly updated from comic and it doesn't have yellow boots. Also Earth 2 characters are a bit more comic booky in tone. Barry Allen's outfit has seen several alterations since obtaining his powers in a strange accident during the course of the show. Every step along the process has pushed it closer and closer to the accuracy of a comic book. Several versions of the Scarlet Speedster have also evolved from the Arrowverse's various corners. Each had its own distinct style, with even identical cartoonish features like Jay Garrick's helmet making the leap from page to screen. As a result, viewers have been anxious to see them as part of Barry's ensemble come to fruition. He might utilize the golden boots to connect to the new power source. Likewise, because the artificial speed force is still new, it might act as a safety net between Barry and any negative consequences. As a consequence, the end outcome would not only please fans, but it would also have a purpose in the plot. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel. See you soon.